Hi everybody, Lucifer here, and I'm back in Minecraft. Now, for some reason I needed to um, change my game settings a bit, otherwise the game was too laggy. But yeah, this is Dimmy's Realm, so it's creative, and as you can see, I'm in the end. And as you can see, I kind of went a bit mental and well for one thing I have a tree that acts like a water source for this lake second thing is I have corals, seagrass, fish, squid, turtles and dolphins in the end and I also have kelp because kelp but I actually want to well completely terraform an island in the end so one thing I'm actually gonna experiment with is wait gonna need that Is the coarse flower? Because I know that this thing can be okay. I know that. Know that this thing can grow. I I just don't know how. Um, don't know how, and I don't feel like looking on tutorials, so, yeah, that doesn't work. Do I need to put it on dirt? Not dry. Dirt. I'm gonna need dirt anyways if I want to terraform this. Uh, oh, so it does grow. Okay, so it does grow. Very nice. That's good to know because I actually didn't know how this works. And it only grows on end stone. Okay, nice. Well, I guess I'm just gonna start terraforming now. This is kind of bad because I want... I need to designate what I want in what place. So let's say I leave... Well, at least this little hill. For the course uh, plant. Actually, I can leave all of this for that. Everything else is going to be terraformed uh, to a bigger or lesser extent.
Well, I have finished the build pretty much. As I said, this part is reserved for coarse flowers and yes, I spawned some cows here. Although they mm. seem to prefer humping the bamboo for mm. some reason. We have pandas, we have ruins with the end portal. And this is pretty much a jungle. Not a very big jungle, not a very dense jungle, but some bamboo, some horses, some, well, zombie horses. Oh, I know what I forgot. Uh, melons. Because you can actually find these in the jungle sometimes. I'm gonna place a couple of them there and just one here. I also have skeleton horses and baby skeleton horses. And zombie horses, because why not? I basically spawned everything. Pigs, cows, uh, sheep, panda, horses. I didn't go for violent mobs because no. And yeah, there's a couple of acacias here. I do not like how they actually look. But it kind of gives the vibe like this part is a bit more arid. Because the only bottle... bottle? The only body of water is the lake. And it would make sense that... Well, I should actually build a small lake here, I believe. Um, because then it would make sense. We have a big body of water there and the biggest trees are here. And then there's a bit of an aquifer over here as well. Okay, nope. That is bad. I need grass. So yeah, it would make sense to have big trees where the water is. Don't need a lot. Uh, let's just say something like this. Yes, that means I need to fill this with water as well. Okay, nope. Definitely no. I didn't actually think I would do this because I thought that one... Uh, the one lake I have on the island would be enough, but since I'm trying to, well, kind of make it logical how I place stuff, I actually do have to do this, otherwise I would just go crazy. Okay, yeah, that's nice. And since we have water here, I can also place some Sugar cane, just in case. Just one. Oh yeah, I didn't spawn chicken and... I didn't spawn any chicken until now. Completely forgot about that. Okay, this has gotta be a chicken place then. And I am going to place uh, pumpkins, because pumpkins. I like making pumpkin pie in Minecraft, so that's pretty much why. And here you have everything to do that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. The build is done. It took me way longer than I'd like to admit. But I do like how it turned out, so yeah. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Yours to do and mind hope for. 
and I'm actually open to suggestions if anybody wants to see a specific build. And bye.